And I'm gonna show you how to take this out when it's barely stuck in there. I have a secret trick that's gonna help you remove this. First, I took off everything. I wasn't able to get the video, but um, I decided to record this video because I knew I was able to take this off. I'm gonna get rid of that. So you see how it's almost all the way out. This thing was very, very, very hard to get out. So what I did was, I got a pair of these pliers here. I was, you know, trying to take it out from this top part here. I was trying to take it out from this part here. But sometimes if you take it off of this, you'll pull this whole rod out and then you'll really be in some trouble. So my best advice to try to take this out easy as possible, you're gonna get your pliers, you're gonna hook it, grip it right here, tight. So that way, and side to side, and pull on it lightly. Don't pull on it too hard because this is plastic, and this will break. Um, but yeah, this is how it comes out very easily, and boom, it's all out. That easy, that fast. This is the Moen uh, 158084 1220 piece. It came out very easy. A little bit of the rubber is what holds it in. Could turn the water back on and let the pressure blow everything else out but um that's basically what i did to take it out now to put the new one in obviously this is the new one here the new one is here this is the brand new one this is what the new one looks like make sure when you buy this when you buy this piece, you want to make sure your your number of the product matches or else you will have a tough time trying to put that in. So it does come with a little bit of grease as it comes in the package. You want to grease it up all this in the back before you install. You know, um, so let's do that. I'm going to put this in. We're gonna put this on a little bit of grease on here uh, before we install just to make sure we don't have this problem again because the original people that did this project didn't put grease on it enough and it was stuck in there I was there for 30 minutes trying to take something out that wouldn't come out it was a headache so I found out a trick that got it out almost spent two hundred dollars on a plumber a plumber almost two hundred dollars almost got charged by a plumber to come out just to come out and look at it he was charging me 75 so i said you know what i'd rather try fixing it than paying someone so here it is we're gonna put the new one in put it We got the new one in there. We're gonna push that baby all the way in there. Make sure it works. All right, hold it. We're gonna do the same procedure we did to take it out, just to install. Make sure you put this in correctly or else it's not going to work. You want to make sure it's back enough so you can fit the pin. There it is. It has to be flush. It has to be flush in there, hot and cold. There's a pin that goes right up top. That's going to go in there. And then once we put that pin in there, you're all set to go. Your water will be back together. See if this pin will fit back in there. And this pin is definitely gonna fit back in there. We're gonna just have to see how we're gonna fit it back in there. All right, let's see 